Yeah, my name is Apostle Charles Anochimenu, the head pastor of Apostles Continuation Church. Over here, um, we have having vaccination here for the Ghanaian community and also other people who are around who were registered to come and be vaccinated. We were expecting more people. In fact, it's overwhelming. We did not estimate that such people shall come. But we are seeing many people coming. Already many have come and gone, and many are also lined up outside. And I know for sure a lot will also come after, because we're living here at 6 o'clock. Yes, first of all, I would like to thank uh, our president, Mr. Dudu, and his team for a wonderful job they are doing for the community. And I'm also thanking all Ghanaians over here in Toronto coming in their numbers. And I'm sending a message, pleading with each and every one, that each and every one should be vaccinated. It's very much important that we protect each other. If we are all vaccinated, I think we will be able to bring down this pandemic and we will come to a normalcy that all things shall be normal. We can go back to church, go back to work, social life, everything will come to normal. So that's my appeal to the community. Okay, my name is Munira Mahama, a volunteer from DCAO, from the Welfare Wing, and I'm here today to support the vaccination that DCAO is coordinating with the Toronto Public Health. And um, we are just excited that this is happening within our community. What we did was we compiled names. We got names of community members that are interested in taking the vaccine. We also did some education in terms of the importance of taking the vaccine versus not taking it and made several phone calls followed up and booked appointments on our list i think we booked over 600 people so far and we're still booking people that are online that were not registered so this is an opportunity most people haven't had and we are privileged to have this within our community. We're just not serving the Ghanaian community. We're serving different population and different ethnic groups. So please come out and get your vaccination so that we can be safe and go back to our normal lives. So my name is Emmanuel Quay. I'm an executive for the Ghanaian Canadian Association of Ontario and also the chairperson for the Ghanaian Canadian Heritage Centre. Today we are vaccinating our community members, which is the Ghanaian Canadian community. We also would like to thank the uh, Toronto Public Health uh, Professionals and also the uh, City of Toronto um, of office that helped collaborate this to make sure our community members get the vaccination. The frontline workers are here and also we have first responders who are helping man this um, vaccination. So. Uh, our sincere um, gratitude goes to them for everything that they are trying to keep our community safe and this is good for all our well-being. Good morning everyone. My name is Felicia Bochui. I'm the senior uh, chair for GCAO, Ghanaian Canadian Association of Ontario. We are happy to be here today. Why? Because our people are here. Most of the people here are from the Ghanaian community and they are here to get their vaccine. That means we are doing our diligence. We are listening to what the government is saying, that we must have the vaccine. So Ghanaians are here today to get their vaccine. Yes, seniors, seniors, seniors. This message is going for all seniors, GCAO seniors, Ghanaian seniors and all seniors that at our age it's imperative, it's very important that we get the vaccine so that we will not catch COVID. Thank you.